Good evening, brethren. Uh, this evening, I just want to quickly share a message with us today. As we continue to see things to unfold in the world, I want us to know how the AI is going to play a very crucial role towards the mark of the beast and, you know, the end of the world. We've seen so many technologies coming out and many of us are just, you know, plugging ourselves into it and using it. But the bad news about this is that this technology, software, or whatever they call it, is actually going to play a crucial role towards the, um, the system of the beast. They call it the one word, the uh, new world order. It's going to play a very crucial role towards this. I just saw an article, and I'll say I'll quickly share this with us. It's called the uh, Fin Extra. It's the company that is in charge of this. And it says the uh, Universal Universal Digital Payment Network, uh, Universal Digital Payment Network. So this payment is going to be a global payment, and it was launched at the just recent World Economic Forum in Davos. So they've launched this. It's going to be the the digital currency for the future, well, which has been launched now. So, and there's so many countries like Tokyo and others have already started using this. So this is it, folks, a universal digital payment network. So we can see the B system forming daily, and we can see the technology, we see them putting in place everything to kickstart the B system and to get rid of the old system. What we are seeing today is the destruction of the old system to pave way for the new system. Um, everybody on the internet has been mad, especially the YouTubers, about Chat GPT. It's one of the open AI that has been launched. Then you have the Doll He2. Then you have the Whisper. You have so many of them out there. But Chat GBT, actually, Chat GBT, sorry. Is actually like the end of workforce as we know it. Many people are excited using it, using it to scale, but I know with time that will be the end of, you know, what we know as going to work and coming back, especially for the software developers. So um, I just want us to quickly read the book of Revelation, Revelation 13, verse 4. And they worship the dragon which gave power to the beast, and they worship the beast, saying, who is like unto the beast? Who is able to make war with him? So we see the system empowering himself, and you see these people announcing this, whatever they want to do. We know fear. They've got no fear. I mean, nothing will happen to them. They just need to tell you what they are doing. Nobody is opposing. Nobody is fighting. Your protest or whatever will not stop anything because the decision has been made for them to do whatever they are doing now. Revelation 13, 17. So that no man was able to buy or can buy or sell unless they have taken the mark or the name of the beast or the name, the number of his name. And that no man might buy or sell save that he had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. So we can see no man will buy or sell unless they have the mark of the beast. And this is, the, you know, we can see us heading towards it. I want us to know that the AI, you know, the internet, the technology is going to play a very crucial role in the beast system. And we can see it taking place. Everything is being digitalized. If you go into Amazon, there's Amazon Fresh in London, where I live here. And when you walk into Amazon, you just need, you don't need to pay, you don't need to do anything, just use, you know, you've got the app on your phone, you, you know, just scan the app and you can go to pick whatever you want. You don't need no cashier to serve you and you just walk away. And your payment, you know, you're just being charged for what you've used because this, the camera can just pick you up and charge you straight away for what you use. This system could be good if it wasn't meant for evil, but we all know that the system is not good for man. This system is there to control people. The system is there 
to oppose everything that God has made. Everything that God has made is being pulled down right under us. Climate change is causing this. Climate change is causing that. You can't farm. You can't eat. You can't do this. You can't. Very soon you find it difficult to breathe. And that's where they're taking you to. The only people with life and the only people with hope is as many people that put their life in Jesus Christ. As many that put their hope, they are trusting in. Those are the people with hopes. Those are the people with life. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and life. Whoever come to me will not, be, will not perish. He said, whoever come to me, and no man come to the Father except through me. So Jesus Christ is the life, is the hope of any man today. The world as you know it is already gone. I keep saying this. If you've not received Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, you can see many things happening there. It is time for you to connect with God, not AI. Many people today are connecting all their life in AI. You need to connect with God. You need to reconcile, have a relationship with your father. Give your life totally to him. Let him come into your heart. Let the Holy Spirit dwell in you. Let, it, let the Holy Spirit teach you how to live. Folks, many people are sleep, walking, sleeping. That's what we have now. For we are in a very interesting time in history where everything that we've known as life is being transformed into what a virtual life everything has to be you know transformed people are keen into ai logging into ai connecting with ai and disconnecting from themselves and from god that made them everything that is organic is being pulled down and called climate change so that is where we are now and I want you to know that Jesus is coming soon. He said, when you see all these things going on, he said, look up for your salvation draws near. Jesus Christ, the son of the living God, is coming soon. Tell people, preach to your neighbor, preach. Don't be ashamed to tell people. People will laugh at you. They will look at you that you're stupid, just like Noah did in the past. Tell them what is coming. Give them the solution. Give them the choice to follow Jesus Christ as the only hope. God said, I have said before you life and death. So as many that want to choose life, they will find. As many that choose Christ, they will find life. As many that choose the word, everything about this world will perish away. Jesus said that heaven and earth will pass away. Not one drop of my word will go unfulfilled. And we can see everything that he told us while he was on it. We are the last generation seeing this. I just saw the scientists, they kind of give a doom, dark and gloom like they always do, and say we've only got 90, 90 seconds to enter the doom, you know, where the whole thing will just collapse. I don't know what they are talking about, can't be bothered. So we can see that the AI is going to, that's the real message I brought this The AI is going to play a very crucial role. Very crucial role. Your phone that you use, the apps that are in the phone, they are going to rule your life. They are going to tell you where to go, when you should go. If you've, if you've heard about China, what's going on now? The app on the phone is what is ruling their life. They can't go out without the app on the phone. It has to clear them to go out. They use it to do the payment. They use it to live their life. With, they use it to do their shopping. With that phone in China, you cannot exist. And this is what is coming all over the world. This is what is coming to us all. I want you, like I keep saying, get yourself ready. If you know you're not going to conform to the system of the world, you're not going to conform to the beast system, get yourself ready, get food, get shelter, get yourself ready. Because life as we know it is already gone. Jesus Christ, the son of the living God, is coming soon. Receive Jesus Christ. Occupy until he come. Wake up as many people that you can. And this is all we need to do as believers. We, we are not afraid. We are not intimidated. We are not bothered about what is going on out there. Our hope is not built in this world, but in Christ Jesus Christ. 
Thank you so much for listening to me and for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. Share this message to as many people that are not aware of what is happening. Tell them that Jesus Christ is coming soon. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you and bye-bye.